now we're going to change the functionality of the SW4 DIP switches to um, basically send function settings for changing the operation of the system. Uh, first you need to turn SW6 number 10 to the on position. That's what changes the functionality. Once you've done that, you can import SW4, DIP numbers 1, 9, and 10 to the on position. That, that initiates function 769, which is test run. You need to hold in this red button here for around three seconds. After three seconds, LED3 lights up, and that means it's accepted the demand, and the system starts up in test run. If you want to cancel the function, very simply, you just hold the button again, LED3 will go off and that means the function has been cancelled. You can then turn all of the dips back off, so SW6 number 10 back off and SW4, 1, 9 and 10 all back to the off position and the screen goes back to normal.